Number four. I think it's fair to say this was the most exciting one of the whole, the whole set. Um, it was... West was first. It was one spade. Pass. That's not worth a two half bits, nor is it worth a Michael's a bit if you're playing it. One spade pass, two no trumps, Jacoby. Now the reason a splinter is not available here is because you should not splinter with single tenaces. This is two controls, first and second round control. You're going to win all the hearts, assuming spades are trumps. So this is much, much better to use Jacoby here. So one spade, two no trumps, uh, they're passing. First ace you come to is three diamonds. Again, the reason I would control bid is because your hand is not minimum. You've got a 15 count, your ace king, ace king. It's, it's, a good, it's a good hand. So, three diamonds, three hearts. Yeah, the first control you come to. Okay. Notice clubs is not cheaper than hearts here, mm. because clubs has been denied. So, three diamonds, the next ace you come to is three hearts. You've got to be a little bit careful with that. So, one spade, sorry, one spade, two n, three diamonds, three hearts, ace of hearts. Either three spades or four clubs. Uh, yeah, three spades or four clubs. Three spades says, I'm marking time. Four clubs says, I've got second round controlling clubs because you've already denied first round control of clubs. It's up to you. Both are very similar because you know your partner, you're not taking any, away any, any bids your partner might make. So I think four clubs, but it doesn't really matter. Um, so three hearts, four clubs. And this must be second round control because you've already bypassed three clubs. So now from East perspective, we've just learned that our partner has the ace of diamonds and the king of clubs. That's pretty good, isn't it? The only thing we need now is good trumps. So now it's time for four no trumps. You don't need to keep telling them about all these controls you've got because you know enough information now. <coughs> so take the wheel. Mm -hmm. Four no trumps, five clubs, none or three. One, two, three. That's why Roman key cards quite important, really, because you find out about the trump quality. And it's one, two, three. Can't be zero because they've already told you about an ace. So your partner now has king of clubs, ace of diamonds, ace king of spades. <laughs> They're a dream. So what more could you want for seven spades? Yeah. So off you go. Seven spades, um, it sort of plays itself really. There's not much to the play. The bidding is the tricky bit, getting to seven. I suspect most pairs, if this were dealt randomly, although I'll appreciate it wasn't, yeah. most pairs will get to six spades here because the hands are so good together. But seven is where control bidding is vital. Because the fact that you don't care about the king of hearts is relevant. Because yeah. if you did go four no trumps then five no trumps, you'd find out you're missing a king and then stay out of the Grand Slam, in theory. Because you've done your control bidding, you know they've got all the cards you need. Mm. You don't care about the King of Hearts. Mm. If they have it, great, but who cares? So, the only chance this Grand Slam can go off is if something is breaking really bad and they lead it. So diamonds are 6-0 or clubs are 6-0 and they lead it and they can get a rough on the opening trick. That's the only chance they have. Which is, like, millions to one or something. Mm. So it's a very good Grand Slam. Um, North is going to lead the King of Hearts because it's top of a sequence and they think that's their best chance. They set a half trick up, that might be the contract. As it happens, it doesn't, but that's the best thing you can do. You win your ace because you're forced to. And now really, the only losers you've got to worry about in your hand is this third round of clubs. Well, and that heart. So you just draw the trumps in three rounds. I'll do it. One, two, three, one, one, two. Three. They're discarding something, hearts, let's say. One, two, three. Now you can play ace, king, queen of diamonds. I might bother doing the defensive hand, it doesn't matter. Ace, king, queen of diamonds. Getting rid of one of the clubs. And then you just trump that heart into it. Ace, king, queen of clubs is your last three. So it kind of plays itself, really. The bidding is the tricky part. Okay, all happy? Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs>